I love history. One of the things that I would like to do is to write the history of the Virginia Railway Express because I was there at the beginning when it was just an idea. I, Sharon Bulova, do solemnly swear, do solemnly swear, that I will support the Constitution of the United States, that I will support the Constitution of the United States, and the Constitution of the Commonwealth of Virginia, and the Constitution of the Commonwealth of Virginia. So there have been a number of things that, you know, that I've done during my uh, time as chairman, bringing people together, engaging the community. This is an opportunity for people to take a look personally at what is going on in Tyson's. Building transportation. Welcome, everyone. <laughs> The Silver Line project has spanned well over 20 years across numerous administrations, elected officials, and community leaders. As a result of Fairfax County's decision to wind the Silver Line through Tyson's, this part of Fairfax is realizing our vision for a vibrant, mixed-use urban downtown. How do you like it? The sky's cleared up. Beautiful night. We have evenings on the ellipse in the backyard of the government center. And that's not just frivolous. It really is bringing people together uh, with their local government official and officials. So I've been on the board for quite some time and remember, you know, the, uh, the doomsday budgets uh, during the 90s and, the, and then there was the Great Recession. Uh, just as I was uh, elected chairman of the board. <laughs> so, <laughs> it wasn't my fault. <laughs> I think I'll miss it all. <laughs> it, this is a great county. It's, it's been really rewarding to bring the community together, uh, bring our county staff together, and, uh, and focus on things that need to be improved and changed. There is no further business to come before the Board of Supervisors. Our meeting is adjourned. <laughs>